Hello guys, how are you? I am back with some Arduino work. Today I am going to work on Arduino controlling the LCD. How the LCD can be controlled by the Arduino is you are thinking right now. So today I am going to show you how to connect the LCD with Arduino, with which you can make LCD work as your wish. How to put command in it, how to connect anything else with it is what I am going to tell you. So let's get into it. First you need a 16 into 2 LCD and some female and male jumper wire and the important one Arduino Mega. You can also use Arduino Uno. When you brought the LCD you will see that there is a common board on which the LCD screen is attached. So you will also see that there are 16 pin coming out from the board. There are different name on each and every single pin. I am using a I2C board to make my work easy. I am using it because it is converting 16 pin into 4 output pins which are VCC, ground, SCL and SDA. You can found a variable register behind the I2C board. If you twist right and left, you can see the contrast of the LCD is getting high and low and you can also find a jumper. When it remove it, you can see the backlight will stop glowing. Now I took 4 female and male jumper wire. To connect with the Arduino, you have to connect I2C's ground pin to with Arduino's ground pin and I2C's VCC pin with Arduino 5V. I2C's SDA pin with Arduino 20 number SDA pin and last 4th number pin which is SCL pin. Now the configuration is ready. Connect the USB cable with the Arduino to my laptop. So now we have to find out the I2C's bus address to make the know that is a LCD. Now I open my Arduino software. Now I put the commands into the Arduino to help the Arduino find out the LCD's bus address. Now we have to go Arduino software's serial monitor. So you can see this is the bus address. So you have to remember this bus address. My bus address is 0x3f. Your bus address may be different. So now finally I am putting the main command on it. And first I type the LCD name and I2C's board name. Then I type I2C bus address and I2C output name. Now I type rows and column in the LCD. Now I type rows and column in the LCD and then command for lighting the backlight. Now I set the command for showing the prints on the LCD. You can type anything. You can type anything to print on the LCD. And then I set the cursor as 0 column and second rows. It defines that from where the print on the display and I type same. For the second line now and i upload the code now you can see what is it showing right now if you want to know how to work without itc board then comment down below i will make another video on it if you if you want to know more about this installation the comment down below so guys this is for today so if you like this video then give you a thumbs up and support my channel see you in the next video Stay with me while we meet